Okay guys, let's go for a ride. Well, damn. Guess we'll just have to settle for some random thoughts. Okay guys, 2020's been a tough one. We've had the murder hornets, the grizzly gators, the zombies, and then July run around. And now we have laser beam eye kitties. Don't go to the beach. All right, let's jump back before February when I was at work at AT&T. Ever have one of those friends that just kind of keeps you out of trouble? It's kind of like a sounding board for you. He sat in the next cubicle to me and we shared a wall. And all the time I would come up with these wacky ideas and he would generally talk me out of them and say, man, you're going to get in trouble. <laughs> and he was usually right. So he kept me out of a lot of trouble. Well, February the 10th, I retired. So I no longer had him as my backup, the voice behind the wall. Here's a photo of the voice behind the wall, just so you'll know that he is a real person. Well, strange things was when I quit uh, February the 10th, 2020, I noticed that uh, he had a photo come out about two weeks later on Facebook. Not really sure about this photo, but hey, it is what it is. Not that there's anything wrong with that. No, of course not. I mean, it's fine if that's who you are. Absolutely. I mean well, as much as he helped me, maybe I was helping him keep a little secret from the old wife, if you know what I mean. Are either of you uh, homosexuals? You mean like flaming or? Well, it's a it's a standard question we have to ask. No, we're not homosexual, but we are willing to learn. It sure is hard being my friend. Trust me, Chad has dealt with this pack. <laughs> Photo for years now. It is tough being my friend. But you would think by now they'd know to quit posting these pictures on Facebook. <laughs> what else can I do? Well, since I'm no longer working, my wife had to take over the job of being my filter. It's a tough job. It's a 24 hour a day job. She's trying. But this week, my wife went to Naples uh, to visit my daughter for about a week. So that leaves me at home all day long with no filtering. But before she left, she did leave me a few words of wisdom. Lord Jesus Christ, me me Man. So sometimes it makes me think, well, she ain't here, is she? I try to stay far away from religion and politics on my site. That's just something I don't want to discuss, but sometimes I just can't help myself and with no filter, I just have to bring up a Tifa Chaz. I mean, come on. That's just too easy. But you know, they just cleared it out after the mayor's house had a visit. She sent the police force in and they cleaned up Chaz. But I thought to myself, you know, they could have just sent in Snake Pliskin. That's right, Snake Pliskin. That would have ended all their issues immediately and cost the taxpayers a lot less money. Name's Pliskin. Call me Snake. Five minutes later. And remember, once you're inside, you're on your own. Oh, you mean I can't count on you? No. Good. Twenty minutes later. I'm gonna give you assholes a chance. <laughs> what do you say we play a little Bangkok rules? No 
Nobody draws until this hits the ground. And then once the snake cleaned up all the trash, all they would have had to do is send in Josie Wells. Governments don't live together. People live together. In governments, you don't always get a fair word or a fair fight. Well, I've come here to give you either one or get either one from you. I came here like this so you'll know my word of death is true. And that my word of life is then true. He could have set up a treaty and had everything hashed out in minutes. It shall be life. So will it be. I reckon so. Two guys, 30 minutes, all problems of the world solved. But then I remembered from last year when I became unfiltered and she found out about it. I turned around. Wife. Growing. She was 6'10. With a suit on with a W for whooping on her chest. And a cape was blowing in the wind behind her. And a golden belt came out the sky. It was not a pretty sight. So that's all I'm going to say about that. Okay, guys. Day two. Let's go for a ride. Well, damn. Thought if I went out the front door, it might be better. That's a big nope. Happy 4th of July, everybody. Now let's add some fireworks. I'll get out there and grill something. Happy 4th of July, everybody. See you next Saturday, 5 o'clock a.m.